All right, welcome to Smokey Approved Korea. I'm your boy, Journalist. And on this one, we are here to check out uh, my little nigga, JK. He's got a song called Still With You, but this is an acapella version. So how this one is going to work, though, because the reason I would do this was my acapella bar is set high. So I will show you what I consider to be the bar for acapellas. And then we will go over JK. So we won't go through the whole song from the other one unless I really catch a vibe off of it because I, I haven't even heard it in a long time. But uh, that's what we're going to do today. If that sounds like something you're into, please stick around for the rest of the video. Thank you guys very much for joining me. If you could, please hit that like, subscribe. Patreon's in the description. And let's get into this one. So how this goes is we got this one, right? Everybody knows this one. Still with you, acapella is fire. But do you know about these young men right here? Because... If I ever fall in love, come on, blood. Come on. Like, this is a bar, but hold on. Fuck this one at the top. If you ever search for this shit yourself, please, please oh, listen to me. Fuck the music. It is, it's actually trash. This one right here. You see, I've already watched it. This is the one. This is the fucking one. Trying to turn this up as loud as I can turn it. The very first time that I saw your brown eyes, your face said hello, hello and I said hi. I knew right then you, you were the one. But I, I got caught up in physical, physical attraction, but not to, to my satisfaction. Baby, you're more than just a friend. Come on. All right, all right, that's it. Because I'm, I'm going to really catch a vibe. And it's just like, it's not even the right one. I think this one is like seven minutes or something. Not the point, though. So this is my bar. This is just so, like, the harmonies, the precision, the pristine nature of their voices is fucking amazing. So you guys told me I need to listen to my little nigga sing acapella. So that's my bar. So that's why I would like to just state where we're at before we get into this one. So let's see what my little nigga can do. Now. This can't be an official studio version. What is this? This is like a DJ stripped his vocals off of it, unless there, there's like processing on this vocal right now and it's going to disappear. But this is, this is not a fucking acapella. It might sound good to the ear, but this is not an acapella. Yeah, that's a cappella, but this is a Michael Jackson acapella. I'm sorry, I've been listening. I don't know what the boy's singing about. Keep it 100 right now. I've been listening to see how much whether or not I enjoy his voice just on its own without any music. And it's very, it's it's got like that airy huskiness that 
I would enjoy if I was being sung to from a woman. So I probably if if I was a lady or a boy that like boys or a person that just like other people that look like myself, um, I would have to say it's got the tone on it, but. I'm not any of those things. So I'm just like, it sounds really good. This is the type of record I'm like, I could put this on and we could entertain with this record. But it does not have that, uh, the sultriness to it that I'm just like, ah, oh, yeah, come on, come on. But I also, I'm just going off a of voice and the song I played is the, the bar. I also, I know what they're saying. And I'm just like, all that. So now I actually have to go back to find out what the hell he's fucking singing about because I have no idea. <laughs> I was just listening to his voice He has a very good voice though I would say from the voices I know I would put him like a half a step above Jimin But that's only because he sings that high note on uh, Born Singer And that high note on Born Singer is just ridiculous Ridiculous <laughs> Yo, shout out to the air conditioner, Ka. Shout out to the air conditioner. Air con to the world. Literally, I hope everybody gets it. And it does not harm or affect global warming. But I just, we need air conditioner. My little nigga is, is either not singing about what I'm singing about or he's just it's a wild, nasty little nigga. Feet wet. It's a wild time. This is why I'm like, my brain is either taking this to far too of a sexual place or this is not how, like how I'm thinking about the song is not even fucking close to what we're talking about currently. So I I'm, I need a little bit more context. Because it first seems like it's like a, a person that he is meeting or like has a, a situation with, they're doing a the thing, they're not doing it no more. The next time he sees the person, it's gonna it's like it's been a while. So it's like, yo, I missed you. But like a different level of I missed you. It's like and I missed you of just like being open on a level. I, it's crazy how I feel like I understand that I miss you. Cause it's like, yo, telling a bird straight up you'd miss her. It's calm. But like look you in your soul and tell you I missed you. That's a different level of what I missed you. So that's why I'm feeling like we get the tone. But then he's talking about memories rain down like a rapturous rain. And I'm just like, now we're starting to play with waterworks. And when we play with waterworks and music, especially something that feels this sexy, it's normally not rain. It's normally not rain. Like, you make my love come down. She's not talking about rain. She's not talking about rain. Candy rain, it's not candy. It is not fucking candy. Like, rain in these songs, it's not rain. So this is why I'm like, and my nigga's feet wet. So you went from rain to your feet wet. Nigga need a whole new bed set. This is ridiculous. But I could be wrong. I think I probably am wrong, because that's, that's my little nigga. That's wild. Hey, some of my little niggas is really wild. Yeah. I know that sounds way better in Korean, but if, yo, I don't know where we're going, but yeah, the moon looked lonely because it looked like it's crying bright in the night sky. That doesn't translate cleanly to English, but you almost could use that. You know, like, yo, sure, you know the moon looked lonely. I don't know how he could use this shit, but that's a mad line. (laughs) 
This song has to be about sex, but like in the most innuendo way. You want to stay in her sky like a star because you know the morning's going to come. So, yo, I'm going to put in some work. We're going to be here for time. Like, oh, my brain is corrupted or I'm wrong. <laughs> See, this sounds like some Justin Timberlake shit right here. Yeah, that's that Crimea River vibes. Where's Timberland when you need him? I know that's for Army, but I don't understand it. Yeah, my my brain is just, just honestly, it's just too freaky. Because I'm just like, how how you make it turn purple? Like, how do you paint a beautiful purple color? Like, what are we doing here? Like, that's that's one way hell of a way to make a bird blush. I don't understand this. And then the way my brain does understand it, I'm just like, you're going to get demonetized, bro. You can't say that out loud. You you are not allowed to say that. The fucking reaction is there's too much. I'm like, I don't hear nothing. That's the song, cuz? Oh, well, they fucked up. Because that's definitely not what that says. It's silence. All right. My little nigga, still with you, acapella version. I would say... I could give it a nine. Because there's nothing I can say tonally or note-wise that I would find wrong with it. Is it a song I wish I wrote? No. Is it something I could actually use for some activities later? Most definitely. I might get a couple looks because like, yo, why are you playing Korean music during this time? Or just like a foreign language that a person doesn't know. It'd be, it'd be a different vibe. Like maybe some some shorties would be like, yo, I don't I don't really trip. But like, I definitely know some girls would be like, blood. What is this? What is this? This this is not the vibes. This is not the vibes. But a more experienced person for sure hear a, a, a sweet voice and be like oh yeah I, I know the times I know the times overall though uh, yeah I, I'm gonna be completely honest my brain is so fried I don't actually know what this song is about and what I think it's about most likely I'll be informed it's it's not even close to that so how about you guys just let me know how wrong I am thank you guys for joining me uh, if you could please hit that like subscribe Patreon's in the description and I'll see you guys on the next one I'm out of here peace <laughs>